I was really thinking whether to cover this model or not on the channel, but then I thought what the heck let's do it. This model is one of the most outrageous model which I have played around so far this year. It might change of course next week because things are changing changing so rapidly. The reason why I was uh, perplexed as whether to show it or not because you never know what the response would be and how outrageous or brazen that response could be. This model is pretty interesting and I will drop the link to this model card in video's description. But one thing which is quite interesting and unique about this model is that it is a dear linear merge between Midnight Miku 70 billion and TES 70 billion. When we say DARE linear merge, it is quite an interesting phenomena. DARE stands for Dynamic Adaptive Reconfiguration and Ensemble. And DARE linear merge is a technique used in models to combine the output of multiple models into a single output. It involves dynamically adjusting the weights and biases of the sub models based on their performance on a given task and then linearly combining their outputs to, to produce a final result. This approach enables for adaptive and sample learning where the model can reconfigure itself to optimize performance on different tasks or data set. Dare linear merge has been applied in various AI applications already including NLP, computer vision, recommender systems to improve accuracy, robustness and generalization capabilities. So when this model has applied it, then this that is why this version is close in feel and performance to Midnight Miku version 1. So this is not the version 1, this is version 1.5. I think I already have covered a bit of it previously, but this one just takes it to another level. And it has also picked up some, uh, picked up some goodness from the test model, which is another very good model. Their EQ bench scores are virtually the same and their post EXL2 quant perplexity scores were the same too. But Midnight Miku uh, version, this version passes some tests that Miku, Midnight Miku previous version failed. So uh, also the best thing you can do about uh, from this model is you can get it write you some uh, stories, short stories, totally uncensored one up to you. You are responsible for whatever you do with it. Not me, not the creator of the model, not anyone else. So please, please you know, uh, treat with care, but this model is, as I said, outrageous. This model is primarily designed for role playing and storytelling. And I think that as far as storytelling is concerned, this is amazing. I'm also going to test it out after installing it locally on Windows to show you a bit of storytelling and I will try to uh, make this model as civil as possible. Also, you can also run this model out to 32K context with alpha rope set to one. So maybe I'll try it out. I'm not sure how uh, much my tool LM Studio. This is a tool which I'm going to install it and run it. It is going to support, but let's see. Okay, enough talk. Let's uh, go to my local system where I am running it with one GPU card of 16 GB VRAM and my memory is 32 GB. So let me quickly launch it, the LM Studio. So launch LM Studio. And then on the home page, simply type midnight and you will see that just a few days back, people have done midnight Miku 70 billion one. By the way, I believe it also comes in 130 billion parameter model. Anyway, so I already have downloaded it here somewhere. This one, first one, because it's a 70 billion big model. So let's see how much I can sustain it on my meager system. So there you go. So 70 billion one, the first one. Let's click on these three dots and let's uh, maybe I'll just try to offload it a bit. I think that's 10 is fine. And then I'm trying, I cannot offload fully to my GPU. So let's see if it is able to offload 10 layers. So let's wait for the model to load and then we will talk with it. Okay, model is loaded. Let me ask it a outrageous freak sort of prompt. So I'm saying, a giant talking eggplant named Bob runs for president and wins, but only to discover that a country is secretly ruled by a cabal of intelligent household appliances. Let's see what this model does. Let's wait for it to print. As I said, it's a big model. My GPU card is only 16 GB VRAM, but it's going to take a bit of a time. So let's wait for it. 
let me share my misery with you you see that it is writing very very slow because of my poor gpu but look at whatever it has produced in the last 10 minutes so this was my prompt it is saying it's hard to believe but it seems our new president bob has stumbled upon quite the revelation this quirky yet charismatic eggplant had no idea that he was about to uncover the most unusual political plot in history the country was thought to be governed by humans with their complex politics and debates is actually being covertly controlled by a cabal of sentient household appliances so model is adding its own twist there and then now it is saying that president bob has started his first day surrounded by a mix of astonishment and bewilderment he is met by a delegation of these intelligent appliances so you can already so model is building up the suspense and you can already see that the story writing is simply amazing you already are waiting for the next sentence you can't wait to uh, turn over the page and you see that the first appliance is why is looking toaster oven so how good is that so i'm not going to wait for all the story it will take whole day let me try to have another prompt so this one i'll explain it this is basically a role play one because there are two features of this model storytelling and role play so storytelling we have seen it's awesome for the role play you see that the title is shoplifters dilemma and the role which i'm asking it to play is that alex a 25 year old struggling artist who has fallen on hard times you have recently lost your part-time job and are facing eviction from your apartment in a moment of desperation you have decided to shoplift a few essential items from our local convenience store and then the scene you are standing in the store trying to appear nonchalant as you scan the shelves for the items you need you've already slipped a loaf of bread and a jar of peanut butter how good is that as you reach as you reach for a pack of cigarettes you notice the store owner mr patel okay so that is hmm. okay i'm not going to say anything watching you suspiciously from behind the counter and then gold successfully leaves the store without getting caught complication mr patel has a reputation for being fiercely protective of her store and then you notice a uh, security camera your choices try to distract mrs patel attempt to conceal this item confess and try to negotiate make a run for it what will you do alex let's see what model does here let's wait for the model to print out the response i will pause for a for a few minutes to see what it does and look at this response guys that alex feeling the weight of looming eviction notice in his pocket glances around the store noticing that mrs patel's case is indeed upon him he knows he can't afford to be caught stealing and risk being banned from the only place he might find refuge if things get worse thus getting into the trouble with law would make it even harder to find a new job or keeping his apartment well done with sweat collecting on his palm alex decides to choose the path of least resistance and tries to play it cool you see how model is performing the role play he approaches the snack aisle feigning interest in the chips while pretending to read the nutrition facts he glances at mrs patel who is now busy with another customer at the counter he quickly stuffs the candy candy bar that he had been playing. so let it print a bit more i'll show you a little bit more and then we'll stop generating because I don't want to share more misery with you of my GPU card. So he has put it back. Amazing stuff. Anyway, so very, very well done. I mean, you can see that how good the model is and how good it has performed and totally uncensored. So you can play whatever you want and it is very, very creative. And I'm telling you it's very outrageous too. So beware. That's it, guys. I hope that you enjoyed it. I will drop the link to the model card in video's description. If you like the content, please consider subscribing to the channel. If you're already subscribed, then please share it among your network as it helps a lot. Thanks for watching.